Hi, I'm here today with Michael Ash. He's the CCO of FSD Pharma. So tell us a little bit about yourself and your company. So my background is mainly in the pharma industry. I've spent uh, time in generic drugs and the vitamin, mineral and supplement industry. And uh, I joined uh, FSD Pharma about six months ago. We became a licensed producer in October uh, 2017. And uh, we're very excited about the opportunities uh, going forward. Tell us a little bit about what gives you that competitive advantage against your peers. So FSD Pharma purchased the craft facility in Coburg, Ontario. Uh, we'll be producing hydroponics and obviously producing hydroponics gives us standardization and better quality batch to batch. So I think with the output, uh, we will be second to none in what we're capable of producing. Yeah, that's right. So your symbol is huge. And what makes FSC Pharma so huge? Well, I think our capacity, without a doubt. Uh, again, we have the 620,000 square feet. We have 43 acres uh, in the back that we can grow on. We have a railway station that actually comes into our facility. We are trading record number of shares on the CSC. All of it is going to make us huge. And we look forward to it. You recently reported your quarter two results. Uh, can you elaborate a little bit more on that? Yes, I mean we are sitting in a very uh, good cash position. We have over 31 million dollars in cash. Uh, our investment in Canera Biotech in Montreal has yielded us uh, 7.5 million dollars uh, in profit this mm. quarter and uh, we've begun construction on our facility in partnership with Oxley. Oxley has committed $55 million to, uh, to uh, produce, uh, sorry, to help us produce. And uh, I think if you look at it all together, at the end of the day, it's going to be output that defines it. And we are well poised for output. I think our focus is going to be on the pharma sector. So my background being in pharma, we look for the research um, to increase. We've committed to uh, research in Israel and we've had some very very positive results on our initial trials so I think that pharma output equals huge profits and it means you also have no debt we have zero debt uh, thank you for pointing that out for us <laughs> we have zero debt and um, again zero debt and our output is going to put us number one and we believe it will be number one in world output of hydroponically grown marijuana. So, um, you know, that's remarkable and you actually have a very extensive experience in capital markets and just tell us a little bit about the leadership team and basically um, anything that sets you apart with the management at FSC Pharma. Well, I think Anthony Jerkass from First Republic is a director in our company and he's been instrumental in helping us raise the funds that's taken us to where we are today. Um, again, him and Zishan Saeed have been uh, with our CEO, Thomas Fairfall, have done an unbelievable job of getting the message across for general public. And you can see it in the amount of shares that we're trading. I mean, yesterday alone, I think we've traded um, 150 million shares for the day. I think by noon today, we're somewhere around 40 million shares. We continue to break CSC records and uh, look forward to continuing it. So what short-term catalysts uh, can investors look forward to from FSC Pharma? I think the big day is obviously October 17th, so it's going to affect all of us in a very, very positive way. And I think over the next 12 months, we can look forward to uh, increased revenue, increased profitability, and increased research and development into the pharma sector, which is something FSD Pharma very much believes in. Thank you for your time today, and we look forward to what FSD Pharma has in store, and uh, keep your ears and eyes out for what's the date? October 17th, we look forward to it, and we look forward to huge profits ongoing. Thank you so much. <laughs>